Hello and welcome to this video tutorial on how to use Microsoft Word to draw a diagram. I'm going to show you how to use screenshot to clip an image on your desktop into your Word document. As you can see, the Word document is opened as well as the image which I want to include in the document. Now, how do I do this? Let's suppose for the sake of this video that I'm typing an exam which includes a diagram found in my textbook. This diagram may be too complicated to draw from scratch. Now, this is a common challenge teachers encounter when preparing documents such as tests or notes or any word document which may include a diagram. This video will therefore be very useful to such a teacher. I'm going to show you a quick way to have the exact diagram on this page. I will go ahead and show you how to edit the diagram so that it fits your needs. This may include labeling certain features on the diagram or removing unwanted labels as you may desire. The steps are as follows. Step number one. Ensure that the diagram appears on your desktop. If the diagram is found in your textbook, then you have to scan the page that includes the diagram and save it in the appropriate folder. In this case, I have scanned KLB Physics Book 2. I have scanned the, the book in PDF format, searchable PDF. This enables me to manipulate the document in many ways, which I will explain in future videos. Open the document using an appropriate program and ensure that it is large enough. In my case, I have opened the file using a PDF reader such as Adobe Reader. So this diagram is big enough. I want this diagram to fit onto this page at this particular point. So how do I do this? So I ensure that the diagram is big enough, like this. The idea here is to have the diagram opened on your desktop. The process of how the diagram got there is not important at this point. It may even be an image that you have found on the internet and you wish to include it in your document. Step number two. Open a Word document or the page of the Word document where you want the image to appear. So this is a Word document. Ensure that the cursor is blinking at the exact point in your document where you want the image to appear. So I want the image to appear at this point, in this space here. So I put my cursor at this point. Ensure that the ribbon is visible. Sometimes you may find that the ribbon is minimized. In this case, the ribbon is minimized, showing only the tab names. These are the tab names. In this case, just click on this arrow here to restore it. Click on the main tab named Insert. On the group of tabs named Illustrations, click the arrow under Screenshot. This action reveals the windows which are opened on your desktop. So other than the Word document, it reveals this other window. If I had opened many files, they will appear here as separate windows. Do not click on any of the windows as doing that will insert the whole window as an image in your document. Do not do this unless your intention is to have the whole window appear in your document. Our aim is to have only the diagram appear in our document. In order to do this, click on screen clipping.
This action displays a window that has faded out. The shape of the cursor has changed into a plus sign. Move the cursor to one of the corners of the diagram. Let's say somewhere here. Once in the appropriate position, left click and hold. Then drag the cursor over the diagram to select the diagram that you want. Once we are satisfied that the right diagram has been selected, release the cursor. And the image immediately appears on our document. It is just as simple as that. In our next video, I will show you how you can edit the image to fit your needs. Let's say you want a smaller image, you want to remove all these wordings or add more labeling.